So I didn't really finish my video yesterday, so I'm gonna complete it today. I would use an example of what I'm about to tell you, but I ate it. Sorry, hungry. Basically, you take your heart out of the refrigerator. Your heart has actually doubled in size because you have let yourself um, rediscover who you are and you've gotten stronger and you know yourself, your mind, your body, masturbation. And you're a stronger person because of it. And so you take that doubled size heart and you pound the shit out of it. Not sexually, you just hit it. You hit it so much and you flatten it. You flatten your heart. And why do you flatten your heart? Because a smooth, flat surface is stronger than a round mound of flesh. Is that true? I don't know. And from there, you mold your heart. You shape your heart to the shape that you want. And we're shaping ours into heart-shaped. Not like physical, like actual medical heart-shaped, because that's like nasty and kind of looks like a tumor. But like a pretty heart. And so you, you take that pretty heart and you put it on a pan. You put it on a pan because pans support you. The pan supports your heart. The pan represents your body. And the foil is also reflective and kills the haters. And from there you add the blood and the blood represents life and the, your new, like, I almost said like, vaginal rejuvenation. You're pumping new life into your heart with that blood. And the cheese, the cheese is the binding agent. The cheese is the fat. The fat and heart don't mix. Um, the cheese is the, it, 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 it makes you stronger, it keeps you together, it is. The cheese is the life seed. It is the strongest part of the heart organ. And from there, you add the toppings. And the toppings are, you know, all the things you learned from your hibernation, all the, all the new skills, all the, all the new friendships, all the new experiences, those, those all go on top. And from there, you stick it in a 350 degree oven for 15 to 20 minutes and enjoy. I am still not sure if this is a advice video or a food tutorial. You decide.